welcome my fellow Somalians. Uh, today is a very spontaneous food review. I don't have my camera gear, just literally just the camera that I'm holding right now. I don't have the tripod, I don't have the microphone, so you're just going to have to excuse me for the bad sound quality. But um, I'm actually in the UAE right now, stopover flight. I came from, obviously, you know, if you've seen the vlogs, you know that I came from the Maldives and I'm on my way back to London Heathrow. So here in uh, Abu Dhabi, and quite peckish, it's quite late night. It's actually, it's actually midnight, but um, I thought I'd come and get some McDonald's and uh, ordered it and I thought, you know what? Let me review it. Let me let me compare it to you know McDonald's in the UK. Firstly, got large drink. The drink is actually larger than the the large drink in um, in the UK. It actually looks like a super size. So back in the days, UK used to do super size McDonald's, and that's what it looks like. Went for the big tasting. One of my favorite burgers from McDonald's and obviously the large fries. So I'm going to sample the fries first. It tastes slightly different. Can't quite put my finger on it, but I think I prefer them. It's a subtle difference, but it's a difference that I do like. I already know I'm gonna like their Fanta because let's be honest, Fanta in the UK has been going downhill ever since this whole sugar situation and everyone's been getting, you know, complaining that everyone's getting the bees and they're swapping the sugar with all this artificial sweetness. So all our fizzy drinks taste like crap now. So I already know this is gonna taste better. Now, I mean, look, you can see how orange it is. It's very orange. And just as I said, it tastes much better than the Fanta in, in the UK because obviously they're not swapping it with sweeteners. Now, I'm going to try the big tasty. Oh, so when you open it up. Comes in a wrapper. Doesn't really look like a big tasty. It looks more like a quarter pounder without the cheese. But the assembly is on point. It's a lot more. Um, well, it's better assembled than you know the typical burgers in the UK. McDonald's in the UK they tend to have a, a bad uh, rep for assembling their burgers. But this looks good. Well, it tastes exactly like the big tasty in the UK. Exactly the same. I can't, you know, I can't uh, see any difference. The only thing is, you can't get the bacon option because. Um, I don't really like pork over here, so if you're a pork lover and you like the bacon, well, you can't get it with the big tasty. All in all, I think this meal is much better than you know, your big tasty meal in the UK. The price came to 39 dirham, which works out as roughly my maths is right, works out roughly nine pounds. Because I think the conversion rate is about 4.8. Um, if I'm wrong, I'll put the uh, correction there. But yeah, I think all in all, it's pretty decent. Slightly more expensive than your McDonald's in the UK. But then again, you are getting large, a large drink. And I think the fries are slightly larger as well. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're larger. They, they look like the super size, the super size size. 
back when the UK did super size and you'd ask for super size, you get a super size fries, super size drink, except this is large instead. So yes, yeah, it's definitely larger. So actually, I'd say it's actually better value. So it's slightly more expensive, but then you're getting more. But um, yeah, you just have to excuse me for this poor, poorly assembled review because this was not planned. I just thought, while I'm here in Abu Dhabi, waiting for my next flight, I'll do a quick review and um, there you go. So if you did like the video, give it a thumbs up, comment below, share the video. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my channel because I make videos every single week. So, till next time, peace. Oh.